text very quickly i just want to talk a little about the hebrew the hebrew word uh, for fear is pahad and it's a very strong verb of fearing with the emphasis on the immediacy of the object of fear in other words you're doing fine until something shows up that sets you off to the point where you even begin to tremble it's a strong emotion of fear i don't know have you ever been there but i've been there in my life where i was just about having a panic attack anybody familiar with panic attack it's the kind of place where you can't find any peace it's the kind of place where you think you're going to lose it at any minute and generally it has been stimulated by something that's external that's trying to become internal uh, it's trying to break into where you see satan just doesn't want you to have experiences without leaving a mark uh, what he wants you to do is go through something that leaves you psychologically debilitated so that the next opportunity for you to make a move you're so caught up in the past with the things you have failed in that you will not take a step that is guided by the Spirit of God oh he wants to break you down have I told you touch your neighbor yet oh, it's coming just hold on uh, it's a critical piece because now it's the object that causes fear that allows the subject to tremble and the whole point is to intimidate and, and break you down to feel as if you cannot stand in the midst of what's about to happen uh, the Lord said to the judges in Israel he said fear not the face of men uh, don't let any social position or any adversary in any litigation intimidate you and sway you from your judgment if you know this thing is right then stand to it uh, the next Hebrew word was one that is to pursue or cast down it it's a word that talks about driving uh, the enemy wants to drive you and again we're talking about external stuff we're talking about horrific people horrific situations that are designed for the outward display to generate an inward breakdown how long are you going to be there with all of your talent and allow some little chip that's missing to keep you from being all that you can be uh, when are you going to get over what you didn't achieve yesterday for what you can achieve tomorrow uh, when are you going to allow yourself to be released from satanic control over your mind because you are already gifted but what satan wants to do is use your sensual perception to cause your environment to control your thinking what god wants to do is allow your faith in his spirit and word to talk to your mind to tell your mind that you're not driven from the outside but you're driven from the inside and when you stand up with what's inside what's outside has got to bow down oh, i feel something helping oh, just give me give me just a few more minutes and i'll be through <laughs> Ich weiß, ich bin ein Kaiser. 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 Ich